Hi friends, welcome back to my channel. It's me Pratyusha here. In this video, I wanted to share some kitchen cleaning habits that I follow to maintain a clean kitchen. Kitchen is the heart of the home, so it is important to maintain it clean and it is also most happening place in my home. So it takes same amount of time to clean the entire house and the kitchen in my home. So these are some of ideas and habits that I have learned to maintain a clean kitchen. Please look at into them. And if you like this video, please share it with your friends and don't forget to subscribe. Clean kitchen countertop is the key. So if you maintain a clutter free countertops, then the whole kitchen looks very clean. So, so this is the most important part of the cleaning habits. I have a kitchen cleaning routine in the morning and in the night after I cook. So this is the before situation before the cleaning routine and so this is the after I clean the kitchen. So having routine is important to maintain a clean kitchen. Putting the things back into its original position while you are cooking. This saves a lot of time later in the cleaning. To maintain a clutter free countertop is a good habit. Find a home for newly purchased item. Here I have purchased this self stirring mug. I am trying to find it out the new home for it. So I am checking in this bin or I am going to fit it in this place. So also declutter the items as much as possible. So here I have purchased some uh, scissor. So I am going to declutter my old scissor. Mopping the kitchen every day or every other day uh, helps the kitchen to keep it clean. Otherwise, it is going to be sticky. These are the wet wipes. I have made a video how to make them by using rubbing alcohol and dish liquid. I made a separate video how to make them. So these are very much useful in wiping the kitchen splash and also countertop. So it is a good practice to wipe them every time while cleaning the kitchen. Keeping a small trash can with a cover near the sinks helps a lot. We can put the vegetable peels and leftover food. So in this way we can also avoid leakage in the trash can. So it's a very useful. Make a habit of cleaning the kitchen cabinets frequently, weekly once or two weeks once. Because it is becoming too oily when we are cooking. Making a habit of cleaning the nearby appliances like dishwasher, fridge and oven keeps a clean kitchen. Have a separate brush to clean the corners of the garbage disposal area and near the sink hole because the dirt is accumulated and so we need to give special attention otherwise it is very hard and it's better to clean with the baking soda along with the dish soap and clean it nicely. Make a habit to clean it regularly. It is also a good practice to clean the water tap and the behind area when we clean the dishes so that that part is looking good.
making a habit of wiping the any spills immediately will reduce a lot of work later making a habit of cleaning the oil can and also some other containers on the counter top after the cooking is a good habit I always keep my kitchen appliances like sandwich maker, blender and mixies in the pantry after I use them so that my kitchen counter will be clutter free. I made a separate pantry organization video please. Empty dishwasher gives the place to keep the soiled dishes or clean dishes into them. So it is a good practice to clean up uh, empty the dishwasher after every clean. taking away the big containers from the counter top gives the more space on the counter top so that it looks clean so it is a good practice to make keep them away immediately taking away the cleaned vessels from the counter top will give you so much space so instead of this one i am using this uh, towel so that we can take it away and we can dry it up so this will be useful when you are in a hurry and the counter top will be looking very clean my kitchen counter top is a magnet to collect all miscellaneous things look at this bin how many things are collected in this year so i kept a small bin to collect all of them and whenever i get time i will try to dispose them off transfer the cooked food into small containers will save a space on the counter top so that it looks cleaner so making a habit of cleaning the dish sponge and dish brush and all the things that are kept on the counter top after we clean the dishes is a good practice so in this way i am cleaning everything here and i am taking out the trash from the small can and even i am cleaning the sink here and also keeping a clean sink is also a good habit instead of waiting for deep clean cleaning inside the cabinets whenever you get some time while cooking so that in this way our cabinets inside will be clean always so this is a good practice to implement Taking out the trash every night is a good habit. That is the reason I have selected this small bin in my home for the kitchen.